Today I'm going to show you how to find out what processor you have on your Android device. Uh, it's pretty simple, all you need is an app to do it that's called CPU-Z. So if you go to the Play Store and then search for CPU-Z, then it'll be the first one that pops up, this one with the purple logo. And it's a free app, uh, just install it, and it doesn't even require any special permissions. So, uh, And you can see it has tons of five-star ratings and everything. Um, once it installs, just open it up and it will just list your processor right at the top. Uh, your processor is pretty important for how fast your phone is, so when it's feeling a bit sluggish, then you can kind of look it up and see if your processor is getting a bit outdated. Otherwise, you could kind of, if you knew it was a newer processor, you could kind of blame your phone. So what it shows you here is, at the top is the what actually the processor is, like the Snapdragon 800. If you looked at that up, you could find out all kinds of information about the processor. And then down here, it's showing you how fast it's running. Uh, like for CPU 0, it's telling you how fast that core is running. So if those were all running pretty high, then your phone would be working really hard and using a lot more electricity than if only the first core was doing something. So, And then your GPU render down at the bottom, that is how well it processes, processes graphics. So like the 330 is a very new platform. Uh, and it works much better for games than an older one would. So if you just want to know a bit more about your uh, phone, like what kind of processor and GPU it has, that's information you can find out right here.